another old white dude dead in a small town in Missouri. Three black people are under arrest for his murder. There's so much to this story that the local news just really kind of doesn't get into. Let's hear the local news and let's hear the full story. Missing Pittsburgh man is located in a cotton field in southeast Missouri. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Lauren Lapka. Investigators with the Sykeston, Missouri Department of Public Safety began searching for 66-year-old Larry Weaver of Pittsburgh, Kansas, earlier this week. Officers say Weaver checked into a Sykeston hotel Sunday night after taking a motorcycle trip with some friends. Police were contacted by hotel staff Tuesday morning after they realized Weaver had never extended his stay for another night. His body was found this morning in a cotton field near Sykeston by an aerial search team. Investigators were able to locate Weaver's missing 2013 Harley Davidson after identifying another vehicle they believed to be involved through surveillance video. Through the course of the investigation, officers were able to identify three persons of interest in the case. Two of those people were later located and arrested Friday night in Charleston, Missouri. Local man accused of murder obviously does not want any media attention. Yeah, he made that clear this morning in New Madrid. Mr. Robinson, get the f out of my face, ma'am. Ma just don't wait for me. Now take that record. That Good morning. Good morning. Do you have anything to say? That was Sheree Honeycutt trying to talk to 49-year-old Ronnie Carl Robinson Sr. He's from Sykeston and appeared in court today along with two other suspects, all accused of killing Kansas motorcycle rider Larry Weaver while Weaver was staying at a Sykeston hotel. The suspects include 40-year-old Elsie Coleman of North Little Rock, Arkansas and 35-year-old Lorenzo Coleman of Oakfield, Tennessee. They're all accused of trying to steal Weaver's motorcycle so they could sell it. Weaver disappeared from that Sykeston hotel. His body was later found in a New Madrid County cotton field. According to the court documents, the three perps set out for that area because it's a popular spot for people who drive these expensive motorcycles all across country. They set out to steal one. They found Larry Weaver's bike. They loaded it on the back of their little, you saw that little trailer. Larry Weaver comes out, the 66-year-old Larry Weaver, fresh off of 20 years, working in the computer department of a local university in Pittsburgh, Kansas. He comes out in his shorts, no shoes, no shirt, maybe a t-shirt in the morning. And he's going, hey, what the hell's up? And they're pulling away. He jumps on the tr he jumps on the, the bed of the truck. Um, eventually, they stop the truck in a in a deserted place. Uh, beat the hell out of him. Tie him up. Drag him out to a, into the middle of a cotton field. Leave him there, where he died from the beatings and the exposure just remember and forgetting the most important lesson of life on the road don't make the black kids angry <laughs> 